Age verification updates by Cloud CRM. So we're going to start by turning on the functionality for age verification. And we see ours is turned on. We have our items assigned and everything that we're doing for tobacco scan data automatically gets uh, age verified. And then we have our advanced settings. Advanced settings talk about driver's license information storing settings, verification screen settings and receipt printings. So let's go to receipt printing. So first of all, we're turning on the print of age verification message on the receipt itself. And then we have three options. We can either just say the word age verified, we can print age verified by, and then also include the verification method. And then we can also let you put in your own message that would you know, uh, constitute the age verification. But let's go ahead and test this one out. We'll do age verify, verified, and then we'll, we'll also talk about the method. The verification screen settings is the methods, right? So we obviously are able to scan the driver's license with just a barcode, barcode scanner. We also can uh, enter the date with the keyboard or use the wheel to select the date, right? So you either use the wheel or you enter the date. Those are the two different options. Um, and then we have the allow for visual authorization option. What is a visual authorization? When you're looking at a person and you know they're over 21 because they're you know nearing 60, 70 or whatever, that would enable you to just simply say, you know, I visually confirmed this person is old enough. And so if we want that option to be available on, the, on uh, during the checkout, we have that on. And then let's go ahead and just use this enter date with keyboard. So now everything is turned on. Let's go ahead and give this thing a run and see how it works. Um, let me just double check what items I have selected. I have my Grizzly Long Cuts. I have my Absolute Vodka. Although this is a Grey Goose. Well, I actually have a Grey Goose as well. So we're good to go. Let's give this thing a run. We're going to open our register app and we're just going to grab our Grey Goose Vodka, for example, and simply scan it like that. Oh, we probably need to first choose the order type. All right, there is a scan and we don't have that particular Grey Goose Vodka. No worries, we'll just scan our Grizzly Long Card. And we can choose this Grizzly Long Card and there is the age verification. Now, we can't remove this screen, we can't avoid it, and we can't get back to the checkout until we deal with this. And there's many different ways of dealing with it. So first of all, we have the manual verification. Second of all, we have the driver's license scan, or we can just remove the item from the cart if you know it's not appropriate to sell it in this particular instance. And then we have the returning customer. Returning customers will search by phone number, all right? So, Let's just cancel out of that. And the manual verification, there's that visual authorization. You press that button and the thing is just age verifies right away there. And then if we want to deal with the loyalty customer, we can just pick one because we don't know who we're dealing with. We're just going to ask to assign a customer and we'll assign a customer and, you know, let's increase and we'll get our discount. Here it is. Um, and so then we can continue to our payment. Um, with age verification and we'll see what our receipt looks like uh, and it says that age verified uh, manually by visual confirmation right so let's just try this one more time we're going to scan our grizzly we're going to pick a grizzly and now we're going to scan a driver's license and We'll go to loyalty customer. See how it didn't ask me to add a customer because scanning a driver's license allowed us to verify one. And so we've added the transaction and then on we can go with that payment. Um, no cancel. And so when we print this receipt, it will tell us that um, age is verified by uh, DL scan. Okay. And so if we go back to uh, the register again, and you know do the scan one more time i just want to see how many different ways we can age verify um, so we did manual verification let's go ahead and type in uh 05 11 uh 1989 all right 
apply. There we go, loyalty customer. We don't know who the customer is, so we pick one. There it is. And then if we do one more discount, there is the discount. We hit pay. Uh, we do no cancel and we click. And there is that printout running low on paper, but manual date of birth entry. You get the idea on the printout and also how it can be. See how, like if we go back to this app here, Cloud CRM, and then we click on this workflow management and we click on age verification technology and on the advanced settings, receipt printing. Um, so we tested this. I think this is the most viable one. Um, and then this is the st storing of the uh, information and then verification screen uh, use wheel and turn that off so i want to see how that looks safe all right so if we go to register and we'll just uh, actually let's start the new transaction and we'll go ahead and scan our grizzly here all right and we're back on the screen, manual verification, and this is the wheel, right? So you can uh, just wheel, same thing. All right, uh, those are the options, and that's the loyalty program update uh, for age verification technology um, with Cloud CRM. Thank you.